Welcome back everybody to some more Let's Play Minecraft. I am Mr. Envelope and we're here in the vanilla world, my Let's Play world. Um, kind of just doing some building again. Uh, still waiting for, I think that goes there, still waiting for um, 1.13 to come out. It's uh, it's taking way too long. <laughs> I'm getting real impatient. I want to go out and start my new base and uh, I know we still got a lot of loose ends to fill up here. Like there's tons of projects that I'm trying to finish up. Um, oh my god you guys. I did I did so much like landscapey work. Um, terraforming and stuff. Over uh, at the forest. Like above here. Wait. It's that way. <laughs> um, I did so much work over there and I'm really really liking how it came out. Um, I haven't seen it in a few days. Because it's, it's been a while. What am I missing here? I think, oops, that was supposed to stay. I think that comes out and we're gonna put a light there. I forget how it looks already. Um, yeah, I really like how that came out. So I've just been doing like tons of stuff like that. Um, tying up all the loose ends, getting ready to leave so I don't just leave like a bunch of unfinished projects everywhere because I don't like to do that. Um, yeah, so just trying to make sure that doesn't happen. Um, and one of the biggest projects that I have not finished is the library, and I've been doing tons of work there, or here. Um, the last big thing here is kind of finishing up the, I guess, this whole side, because I decided to redo it all. And, um, kind of do the floors, because I don't like all these torches everywhere. Um, I, I still planned on putting uh, the librarians and stuff here that I could trade with, but that... Uh, never came to. I never got a bunch of librarians or anything. I've been having, or I haven't been focusing too much on capturing, capturing, <laughs> on capturing uh, villagers. So that that hasn't really been that big of a priority for me. So I haven't been getting any new librarians. The ones I do have, they're already up in the market stalls up there. So I don't think I don't know. I don't want to move them. Uh, they're pretty fine where they're at. I think I can just put one. Whoops. Uh, one lever right here. Bam, perfect. So now this is lit up. This should be good. I like it. I think I'm supposed to put uh, some sort of stone right there. Yeah. Or is that... Okay, I think that's actually this um, hardened clay stuff. Nope. But yeah, guys, basically I'm just... I'm ready to get out. I know I've been saying this for like the past two, three episodes of this series I've been recording and stuff. Um, but yeah, it's it's time. <laughs> it's all I want to do. I haven't played with like any of the snapshots yet. Um, I'm not like blind to what's going on. I know um, I know a lot of the things that are going on in the update, like the turtles, the dolphins, um, the coral, things like that. I've been keeping up with that. Um, but I haven't played with any of it yet, and I'm getting eager. <laughs> I'm ready to just jump in. Uh, let's see. I think... Hmm, maybe I could just move this over. There's no real reason why it was right there. Uh, now this is four wide and it's kind of wonky. I wanted it to like meet up with this, but I don't think that's going to happen. I'm going to put that back. I need to find a way for this entrance to like make sense. I think I'm going to push this wall back a little bit, but we can't go too far. Because we have a, oh, a really small redstone dongle right here. Um, if we come around here. Yeah, this is the Angry Hippie Lady's little monument. That's all the redstone is. <laughs> it's like, a, it's portal themed because we did the portal series together. The goal is to get the little thing to land on the thing. And then you solve the puzzle. Because portal's all about puzzles. <laughs> Very simple. I like that. Ooh, gold found it oh yeah i'm using uh jappa's uh new minecraft textures uh i was or i have been um playing with it on because you know these are going to be the new textures or well, more or less assuming they don't change too much uh and i kind of just wanted to see how the world looked and i left it on and i've been playing with it on and i'm really liking it i think it's everything kind of it looks different but same also you know ideally i'd be using germs texture pack but um i'm trying to keep this series like all vanilla and stuff uh, 
save germs pack for like any other like SMP type of thing mostly but I haven't been on an SMP in a long time so it's kind of pointless I guess I don't know it's just kind of like a little rule I have for this series I think is what I'm trying to say <laughs> uh, let's see oh I wish you could have spruce bookshelves because then I would put books right there and keep this at the same Y level but I'm gonna raise the floor up right here so it goes like that let's fill this up with stone because I don't like holes in my world there we go now we'll get rid of this and all this will be like at a lower level that way you can walk up and stuff I don't know what I'm trying to do <laughs> This is pretty tricky. Let's maybe put that there. Uh, I don't know. Uh, maybe I can put some sort of that right there to keep it kind of uniform with this setup. Uh, oh, I think this is gonna have to stay like this. Ooh, and then I can put bookshelves right here, but then keep the the floor right there. Does that make sense? Here, let me grab some bookshelves. I should have some bookshelves here. Uh, there is one. <laughs> I think I'm gonna have to make some more. Because I'm out. I thought I had a crafting bench there. Bookshelf. That should be fine. Oh, I wish I didn't use my dark oak wood. Yeah, we'll just put those right there. And it, now it kind of looks like, you know, there's books that I can grab. Yeah, I wish you could interact with these. I think that would be really cool. Um, but this is gonna have us come in. Maybe we can have a librarian right here like a checker almost So let's take out some of this wall Not too much. I think like that would be fine There we go Keep it all uniform And put a torch down because I've been getting creepers spawning in here <laughs> They uh, blew up right here and destroyed all this um, I also knocked out this really wonky hallway that I had it I didn't like how it looked we had like an extra small pathway this way it didn't look right and that's what made me decide to um, expand the library a little so I ended up just opening the whole thing like so and I'm still working on it I just barely did it right now so we have like this flat wall here uh, I decided to put like an entrance right here uh, actually, it's not even going to be like an entrance. There's not going to be no redstone elevator or anything. I think I'm just going to have like a hole uh, and put some uh, wheat blocks down, hay, hay bales. So if I want to go up, I can, you know, just oh, fly or I can just fall on the hay bales. Whoa. Or gently glide down like I just did. Uh, and I did some testing and stuff, too. I should survive the... Uh, the fall if there's hay bales down there especially with feather falling so yeah that should be cool um i'm liking that idea so this is gonna probably get out of here this is gonna be like a buildy episode because that's pretty much all i really want to do in the series I'm, I'm i've just been building um not too much for me to actually do uh we're gonna be doing like tons of exploring and stuff once 1.13 comes out. I don't have any ah, dark oak wood and there we go. Just needed to make a few slabs. Yeah, just waiting. <laughs> just doing building and stuff. Uh, one thing in the library I tried to do was like carpets. Um, it'd be an easy way to have hidden lighting. I tried to do something fancy over there. I don't even want to show you. Uh, it's something I learned from Germ. He did it a few times in like salt mine and I guess every other thing he does um, mixing in like carpet blocks and wool blocks so it's kind of like lumpy I don't think I did it right it just looked terrible <laughs> uh, but I've seen him do it and whenever he does it, it looks good but not not me so yeah we're not gonna do that uh, what do I do for the walls I feel like well mm, we might have to do something just like simple like that I think would probably be the best bet not what you do and then yeah just like you know stuff like that I think that'll be fine probably do something oh I don't have any more blocks anymore I just stack that up um, 
Maybe connect it to this ceiling bit. Oh, but then I gotta put another... Oh, look at that. Problem. <laughs> uh, the thing. Uh, I'll, I'll probably do some more of this in a bit. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and start showing you guys the things that I've done. Uh, I had said I wanted to put a... What's it called? Like a cafe up here, and I did. It's very, very simple. It's nothing special at all. Like, even back here is not even done. Um, but this is it. You know, I got some... I tried to base it, like, off of Starbucks, pretty much. Uh, you got, like, just some drinks and stuff brewing right here. Uh, and then cakes, cookies, pie, you know, just little treats, and then your little checkout area. Put tons of... What are they called? Uh, clay pots here. Look like cups. Um, yeah, I think looks okay. Nothing, nothing too great. Uh, and then again, all around here, we got all the different chests full of the different uh, enchants and stuff. We got fortune, silk touch. You know, all of them have a icon, whatnot. Uh, that's what I've done in the library. And then I've done just a little bit of work around here. Um, mostly over here, I made a small little pathway, just a bunch of stairs. Uh, to up here, I cleaned this area up a little bit because it was looking real ugly. Um, I even redid some of the roof because I don't, I don't know what I was thinking. It looked like shit. <laughs> it was terrible. Um, so it's, it's real basic now. See, it's just simple border of a roof. I, I did weird shit like this, <laughs> and it was, it looked bad. I, I might even redo this, but I don't even know how I would make it look okay. Um, yeah, so this is all pretty normal now. Like, I'm still, I'm still working on some stuff. And then, uh, you know, I, I tried to clean this up to make uh, an entrance to this house up here. Um, that house has been there for a long time, but it's always just been, like, alone. I wanted to put, like, a couple more over there, but I don't think I'm gonna do that. Um, just because, you know, I think just the one is fine. Try to keep it more alone. Um, there's like a bit of a retaining wall right there and another one right there. They're both based off of what we have over there. Um, little garden bed for the beetroots. See, you got to do some more stuff right there. Um, and then just another walkway. Super not special. Takes you up here. God, this is terrible. <laughs> I really don't like these houses. I thought they were so cool when I first made them, but... Uh, I don't really like them anymore, but I I'm not going to take them down there. A reflection of what I thought was good, <laughs> you know? Um, so that's what I've been doing over here. I wanted to do the cave system over here, the little pathway to the uh, water shrine, but there's a skeleton here. No. <laughs> um, I want to wait for 1.13 to come out because um, I kind of want to do like a bit of a messy water bridge. And I think I'd have to bring some of the, the river over to make it more worthwhile. Because otherwise, you know, you just jump over. That's easy. You don't need a bridge for that. Um, so I'm waiting for 1.13 to come out so we can do some, like, water stuff there. Uh, that's another thing I've kind of been doing. I cleaned up, like, all the land and stuff up there, but it's not even worth showing. It's just little basic stuff. Uh, but the biggest thing, like I said, is up here. I have done a whole bunch more with this forest i kind of built a small mountain range um germ's been doing some pretty crazy stuff with um a world painter world paint something like that um like he taught himself how to do it and he's been like showing us every so often for like the past couple months uh things he does and that got me like just real excited really into like maybe trying to make this place look even better uh, again, we got this super straight pathway, and I showed you guys I did some more work with this forest. I think I did. I, I expanded the forest, like, a whole bunch. Uh, but I added a mountain range back here, and I feel like... Well, my goal was to try to, like, kind of enclose this whole forest. Because it looked weird when you were, like, looking over, and you just see, like, vanilla terrain in the background. So I tried to make this little mountain range and stuff, um... It's not even little. I tried to make this mountain range to kind of like block it and enclose this whole area. Um, it, it's not meant to be looked at like up close like this. Cause when I look at this, I, I think it looks pretty bad. There's just like sprinkled in clay and it doesn't look right. 
Um, but personally, I think it looks a lot better when you can kind of just barely see it poking through the, the forest. Mm, maybe we should go to the town. I think that's where it looks best. Um, because it's more of like a background build. Like, uh, it's not supposed to be the focus point of anything. See? You, you can barely see it. <laughs> That's why it looks so good. No. I don't know. Uh, there was... I forget where I was, but there was a view I had where I'm like, Oh, th this is exactly what I wanted. Um, I would show you guys from up in the sky, but... I don't have any more rockets. I have one. I'll go try to find a uh, ender chest right now. Uh, but yeah, still, I haven't done too much more uh, in this area. It's still, you know, all redone like I had. I built a water tower. I don't know why, but I did. I think that came out pretty cool. Uh, what can I throw away? All right. So let's get airborne. And just look really quick. This is all I've done. See, it's kind of funky. Let's try to perch ourselves on one of these trees. Oh, I kind of missed. Whee! Okay. Yeah, this is it <laughs> from above. Uh, it took a long time. I used so much of the stone that I had. I was very happy about that. Um, but I don't know if you guys remember how this place looked before. It was just like super flat. Uh, it came to an end. You could see the birch forest just like standing over here and stuff. That birch forest. Um, and it was just, it was bad. So I wanted to make something to kind of block it. Uh, and I think I did what I wanted. Um, yeah, <laughs> I think, you know, what I had done with the, the hardened clay, I tried to copy what I did back over there. Um, the first little bit of, or I guess right here, first little bit of terraforming, you know, I just sprinkled in some hardened clay because I thought it looked pretty good. I liked how it looked with the stone. But, um, you know, I think I did a little too much over here. And it just kind of looks messy. Like, I don't know. Like, that, is, this is kind of a lot. Oh, I don't have any stone anymore. Okay, we'll just leave that. Um, yeah, it just look, it looks kind of messy now. So, I don't know. I'll probably clean it up. Maybe not. I'm pretty okay with how it looks. But, yeah. That's what I did. And I really like this forest. I think it's super cool. Um, I tried to do something stupid. <laughs> uh, I laid out like an empty lake. Like it got completely drained or something. That's why there's some water here. And uh, the shape that it made kind of looked like a bird. <laughs> and like this is its beak. So I tried to make a bottom beak uh, down right here. And you could kind of see it on a world map. But... Uh, also, it, it doesn't look like it because like all these trees and stuff, they like ruin it. Uh, let's see. Here's the, the whole area. Um, wow, you can't tell at all. So this whole open area right here in the middle, that's like the top of the bird head. And then this little spot right here is like the bottom of the beak. So it's like the bird is upside down. You can't tell at all. It looked way more clear when the trees weren't there, when the clay wasn't there and all like the rocks and stuff. It was all just like brown. Um, I wish I had a picture to show you guys, but I tried to do that and I thought it was super cool, but you can't even tell what it is anymore. It's just, it's nothing. Um, but yeah, I think this whole area looks pretty cool in the map and stuff, especially the town. Like this is one of my favorite projects. It's nothing special. Like these houses are pretty shit, but I really like how just the paths and stuff kind of connect everything and you know, there's just lots of uneven shapes. It's very different from the stuff I normally do, like over here. Uh, you know, we just got like straight pathways and stuff. I tried to round some of the stuff out afterwards, but you know, you, you can see a difference. I'm, I slowly picked up some things uh, from hanging around with like a lot of awesome builders and stuff on different SMPs. But um, yeah, this is pretty much all I've been working on. Like this whole area is still pretty poo. That's like the quarry and stuff. Um, I haven't done anything like with the train station or the witch farm that's up here. Um, everything is pretty much the same, but I'm ready to go start something else. I want to have a base above ground. Kind of have like a base almost like this, where every like little section and stuff is something that I need. Like food, storage, home, you know, things like that. Um, 
I like doing bases like that now. I, that's usually how I play with modded. Actually, with modded, I kind of build like a house and everything's in there, but I have like my farms and stuff around me. Um, this base has been very, oops, <laughs> very different. You know, everything's just inside. It's the stronghold. Whoops. There's somebody here. I hear a skeleton. Oh, maybe not. Um, yeah, everything's just like inside right here. It's it gets kind of boring because like the whole shapes already laid out I feel like I've done as much as I want to here oh god there's a creeper um, I'm just ready to start something new well anyways guys um, I think I'm done <laughs> with the library uh, as much as I want to do today at least probably the last update that I'll show you guys but this is about it. Nothing too crazy has changed. Got rid of all the torches and I put down some carpets. And the carpets are hiding glowstone. That's going to be how we light up the whole area. Uh, there are a few dark spots like right here, but check in F3. It says we have light 9. That should be fine. I hope it's fine. <laughs> um, I'm just going to leave it. I think I'll, I'll be okay with that. Um, and then it just got like random strips of carpet all around. Um, yeah, I think this project didn't come out how I thought it would. Um, I was kind of thinking it'd be a little bigger, uh, a lot more polished and nicer, but I don't know. I'm okay with how it came out. I think it's doing its job. I got all my things organized and everything. That's, that was the main point of this, but I did want to have like villagers stashed away um, with really good trades, but I don't think we're gonna do that because there's just not enough space with the way I set it up uh, I do have this spot set up. It's like a little check-in. We I will get a villager in here at some point uh, I don't know when um, It's a nice little desk. I think got a door leading to nowhere. Just put some black concrete down and This book is our to-do list. I Just thought I should put it there since I don't want to carry it anymore since we're probably gonna have different goals whenever we move uh, this whole corner took a very long time, this whole area, to try to clean up, and it's kind of weird. I got this random uh, spruce log thing, but there's also one here, and it, I don't know, it's kind of weird, but it works. I did it. I think it's okay. Uh, this wall's really plain. I might put, I don't know, a painting or something down. Um, might do that in a few places, but there is one last thing I wanted to try. Um, I have like no enchanting tables in there, which was like a really big idea that I had when um, I went to go make this place. Uh, but I thought I would do it last since gathering obsidian sounded like a pain in the butt. Uh, but now I have so much. That's not a stack. Now it is. Um, and then you need diamonds. Got diamonds there. Oh, look, I, got, I learned a recipe. <laughs> uh, let's see. There we go. Books. Got some extra books right there. Uh, I don't think I'm going to make another um, enchanting table set up. Uh, let's not do the whole stack. Let's just make like eight for now. Uh, I wanted to try something to kind of make this not look so boring. Uh, what if like right there we had an enchanting table instead of the bookcase? Oh, I don't know if I like that. If I do something like that, I can put, uh, probably just a torch will be fine. I could put light right there so it's a little brighter. Uh, maybe, oh, come on. I want you to turn that way, but then, no, that's not going to work. I want it to go into the corner thing. I need the debug stick. <laughs> uh, okay, that's fine. But... I could try to do something like that, you know, just so they have like some added added flair. Just more going on and stuff. Oh, but then it looks kind of weird having a bunch of um, enchanting tables and stuff set up. I don't know. I'll set this up like this and maybe I'll like it later. Just sit on it for a little bit, you know, because it's kind of like a chair, you know, somewhere you can sit. Maybe. <laughs> I don't know. I think it might be okay, um, cause like I don't know where else I would set it up, like, I can maybe put, 
putting something there? No. See, that's that's dumb. <laughs> um, I don't want to have like too many of them if I do do it. You know, maybe it can just be reserved for like whenever there's a seating spot. So right here, I guess I would put one. Something like that. I could put them like on all the, the poles, but then maybe put obsidian down. I don't know. That doesn't look right. I liked the other one better. <laughs> I don't know. I'll think about that. I just wanted to try it because it was part of my original plan, but whoops. I uh, never got around to it. I'm glad I didn't make the full stack of enchanting tables. I'll leave that one there just to see how I feel. Put some light under it since I'm sure that'll help no matter what. Um, oh yeah, and the carpet colors are based off the um, the bookshelf colors. There's like one yellow one, so I just kind of ran with it. But the rest are just red, blue, and green, pretty much. I guess I could have done blue, but it's fine. Um, but anyways, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope I'll see you in 1.13, which will hopefully be the next episode. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out. Bye-bye. Let me know what you think of the stuff I've done that I showed. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys later.